Howdy folks. This week we got just a quick update video. You might remember a week or so ago I was talking about uh, Irish whiskey and Ransom Spirits the Emerald and in that video I made an old fashioned. Uh, when I make an old fashioned with that with something with a lot of rye I like to use a lemon peel instead of an orange and I'll put Peychaud's bitters in instead of just Angostura. Well, Auntie Susan was wondering if I did that because of the Sazerac, which also uses a lemon peel and has Peychaud's bitters in it, and typically is done with rye, uh, and that is exactly correct. So she wanted to know, could we make an emerald Sazerac? And I said, yeah, we can. We can make that. So normally I do a Sazerac half rye, half cognac. I think that split base just is you know more complex, uh, more interesting. I, I like it better. Uh, and when Susan's brother, Uncle Stephen, heard about our Emerald Sazerac, he said that sounded good to him and he's gonna make one, but he didn't have cognac, and so he did his with Emerald and a little bit of Lagavulin 8. You know what, that sounds amazing, so let's make one. Now, I'm sure I don't have to tell you about a Sazerac. Everyone's had a Sazerac by now, uh, and if you haven't, go make one. Essentially old fashions, a little bit of sugar, bitters, uh, a base spirit. Uh, the way, thing that makes them special is how they're presented. Typically, that'll be no ice with a absinthe rinse glass. Then you'll take your lemon peel, express the oils over the drink, and discard the lemon. Uh, at least that's the way I was taught to make it. Anyway, let's give it a try. I mean, Sazeracs are just classy. Mm. Mm -hmm. This one's got that spicy rye and that smoky undertone from the Lagavulin. Oh, this is, I mean, this is really good. Anyway, the moral here is that if you like a Sazerac, or any drink for that matter, uh, don't be afraid to swap out the base spirit or switch an ingredient. You know, do some experimenting. You might stumble across something awesome. So, cheers. Now, go take a look at these ducks. <laughs> 